سلام Hello to all of you. Today, in a short video, I want to test this generator, which you watched the previous program make, with this steam turbine. With this test, we want to see if it works well with our steam turbine. It is probably not very suitable because its rotor rotates with difficulty and this is due to the proximity of the iron core of the rotor to the stator magnet. I use a large pulley on the generator shaft so that our steam turbine can turn it easily. And on the shaft of the steam turbine, I use a smaller pulley, which means that with a few rotations of the turbine shaft, the generator shaft makes one rotation. I don't know what voltage it gives, I will install it to see what answer we get. I use a digital multimeter to measure the output voltage. Because the direction of rotation is from this side, so the red wire of the generator will be positive. Now I open the steam valve and the steam pressure is almost 10 bar. The output voltage was 28 volts, which, of course, will increase as the steam turbine speeds up. Now I measure the amount of generator current in short circuit mode. The current is approximately 8 amps. We are facing a challenge here, the amount of water in the tank in the center of the dish is low and we cannot finish it all in one hour, and for this I have used a nozzle with a small hole. And if I wanted to finish the water in the boiler tank faster, I would have used a nozzle with a larger hole, and as a result, the generator would work much more powerfully. Therefore, we should be able to get a good efficiency with this small nozzle, of course, with this generator, and in this case, it is easy to charge two 12 volt batteries connected in series, but our power plant must have at least four large batteries. In the future program, I will change the rotor of the generator in a special way so that it can rotate more easily and produce a higher voltage. If we can get a suitable generator for this steam turbine that is both cheap and easy to make and has a good output power, we will pass this stage. You also think about what changes I want to make in its rotor and if you have any suggestion, put it forward. Therefore, we will replace and modify the rotor in the future program. So bye until the next program.